Howdy folks, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another unboxing video today. And as you can see by the size of the box here, this is an acoustic guitar package. Now this comes from Donner. You can probably see their logo here. And this is actually the first uh, thing that I've ever unboxed from Donner. So glad to be working with them. And this is part of a Black Friday promotion. So there's a special deal coming. More about that later. But anyway, let's get this box opened. We've got a bag here, and this is obviously our guitar in the gig bag. Let's get this open. Voila, you can see the Donner logo there. You can see this is definitely an acoustic guitar in its gig bag. We've got a nice big pouch up here. Nothing in that pouch. Uh, so real quick, you can see there's double straps on the back. It's kind of this Cordura-like material, dual zippers, as I mentioned, this thing here. And it does look like, ah, this is one of my pet peeves. It's always one of my pet peeves when the gig bag zipper ends before the bottom of the lower bout. Like, I don't understand why they don't just don't make it go a few inches further because they're always, it's always harder to get the instrument out. But in any case, <laughs> let's go ahead and get the bag open and voila. Here's our guitar. Here we go. Voila. Oh, nice. Very nice. Let's do a quick once over here. Finish looks fantastic. It's a cutaway. I think this is the first acoustic cutaway guitar I've ever had, actually. Um, and we've got a strap button here. We've got black hardware, as you can see. Strap button back here. We've got some black tuners there. We've got the Donner on the headstock that looks like inlay. I think that's inlay, that is not a decal. So that's the real deal. Let's get the, um, the paper off the strings here. We've got a hang tag here with the Donner logo. And then it looks like this has got some guitar chord stamps on it. So here is our guitar. It looks really good. The body meets the neck about the 14th fret, just past the 14th fret here. We do have a binding. I'm not sure if you can see that. The binding is black, but there is a binding there. And then we've also got a binding on both sides of the body, if you can see that. We've got a little rosette around the sound hole. We've got a bone nut and saddle. You can see the saddle there and nut. Um, overall, just really does seem like a decent guitar. But real quick, before we tune it, let's take a look at what else it came with in the box. We've got a shoulder strap, clip-on tuner, cleaning cloth, truss rod adjustment tool. By the way, you can see the truss rod adjustment screw right here through the sound hole. We've got a stick-on pick guard. I actually kind of like that pick guard shape. We've got an extra set of strings here, a user manual, capo, and some picks. So this is a full-on pack. Like you basically got everything you need to get started Let's go ahead and tune this up and hear what the guitar sounds like. Okay, here we go. We got it tuned up. Doesn't sound too bad. Uh, by the way, I did go ahead and put the pick guard on it because I really like the shape of this pick guard. It reminds me of kind of some of the old uh, like hummingbird pick guards on the Gibsons and stuff. Well, let's give it a strum and see what it sounds like. So to be honest, just initial feeling, I feel like this guitar is punching far above its price range. Uh, but more about the price range in just a little bit. Let's uh, try, let's play something else on it.
Let's try some power chords. Okay, folks, so initial thoughts on this one. I mean, this is really a pretty darn good sounding guitar. The tone is nice, it plays good. We've got a nicely set up action there. The intonation seems to be uh, pretty darn good. We've got no sharp fret edges sticking out here. It's made out of good solid tone woods that are giving us that nice woody tone. If I just tap it here that resonant really well made i'm not sure if you can see this but i can certainly see it sitting here there is bracing and curving all through there as i mentioned before we've got a truss rod screw here to adjust it um i mean this is really a well-made guitar and let's talk about the price and the promotion so at its normal price of 169 this package that you saw today the normal price is 169 and at that price i think this is a heck of a value this is giving you a lot of guitar for 170 dollars However, and I'm put a post-it here to make sure that I don't say this wrong, there's a Black Friday promotion going on that Donner is doing. Starting November 16th through November 29th, this will be on sale for $139 for the whole complete pack. Now there's a purchase link in the description where you can get that November 16th through 29th, $139. They may sell out in that time period, but if they don't, if they don't sell out, on November 29th, they'll be dropping the price to 129, uh, and uh, they'll keep it at that price through December 2nd when the price goes back up to 169, um, provided again that they have any left in stock. So um, heck of a deal, nice Black Friday promotion. Thank you, Donner, for including me in this promotion. But I mean, guys, this is a heck of a lot of guitar at 169, let alone 139, let alone 129. So if you could scoop it up for that Black Friday deal, I would highly encourage you to do so. Um, if you're a guitar player and you know, you've been playing for a while and you just don't have an acoustic, I think this would fit you really well. Um, like I said, sounds great and the price hard to go wrong. If you are a beginner and you're just getting to your first acoustic, this is a no-brainer, guys. For for $139 or even $129, you're not going to find something better than this. I, I really would doubt it. So again, the purchase link is in the description. There's no special promo code needed. Just if you go during those dates that I outlined, it should be marked down. So there you have it, folks. Quick overview there. And if you like what I do on this channel, I'd really appreciate it if you would hit that subscribe button for me. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up because that like button and really does help the YouTube, out, YouTube algorithm and really does help out the channel. I don't know about you all, but I think I'm going to keep playing this bad boy. Yeah.